Rated M for Mature. My name is Richard Gilbert. I'm the producer with Blue Omega. Because Damnation is the shooter gone vertical, it's got all these sort of intuitive navigational mechanics and you can just mantle through the entire world. You can climb ladders, you can use zip lines, you can flip up onto a ledge, you can dive through windows, you can uh, swing on flagpoles or lampposts. The acrobatic abilities that the player can do through Damnation is really unique, it's really different and it allows this flexibility that you don't have in a lot of other shooters. You can really intuitively navigate the space. If you're blocked by a gate and there's a window right next to it, you don't have to go run and find some sort of key card. You just dive through the window. It really is about seeing a path and saying, well, you know, in, in the real world, I would go that way. One of the things that we really wanted to do was make it so that the player felt like they were actually in control of the character. I think a lot of times in adventure games, you know, you move the controller left, you move the controller right, and there's a little bit of a delay or a pause. Basically, we wanted to create an experience where the player felt like they were absolutely in control of the, of the character. It's really exciting when you can actually just pull out your guns, shoot a guy, jump to the left, climb up a wall, and, and get some cover, and really start to master the controls, and it really makes it fun and exciting. Exciting. The physical abilities that the player can do are used by everybody throughout the world. So you're going to see your NPCs doing these same moves. You're going to see the AI sort of jumping from a balcony and coming down to get you. You're going to see them using zip lines. You're going to see the AI sort of coming at you from all directions. In Damnation, because all of the enemies are using these same sort of abilities and attacking from all different angles, there is no safe place to hide. They could come down a zip line right over your head and wind up behind you. They could be attacking you head on and then all of a sudden duck to the side and take off into a building and come around behind you. There's really no telling where the AI is going to come at you from. It allows you to decide when you're going to be in combat mode or it allows you to decide when you're going to be in adventure mode so you can either climb and navigate through the environment or pull out your guns and shoot and it really gives you the freedom to decide how you want to play the game. My name is Carl Shell. I'm uh, just telling you a little bit more about the world of Damnation. It's going to be out on the Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and the PC.